everyone welcome to our youtube channel i hope you guys are doing well so today we are going to talk about the analysis of your ugc net exam so the examinations are now completed so we had of course i think september ke kuch days tak we had the examinations and now the cycle is done so in this video we are going to talk about paper 1 a complete overview of the examination that was conducted by nta ugc net that was the exam and the exam analysis ke bare mein baat karenge so this exam was related to the june cycle only of course there was the one paper that was conducted on 18th june so 18th june 2024 2024 we saw for the first time it was nta that conducted the paper offline but of course the ministry declared that yes there were certain problems with the paper and the paper got cancelled so ugc net got cancelled that was conducted by nta as it was said that the integrity of the paper was compromised right the integrity of the paper was compromised so again a date sheet was released and again we saw that the cycle that you that usually happens in june it was conducted when in august and september right so 2 to 3 september tak hua so it was in august the paper happened mostly all the papers all the examinations happened in august and there were certain changes that happened so nta is of course conducting the paper from 2018 onwards we saw that it was nta who was conducted this ugc net exam the most important exam if you want to become an assistant professor or future professors etc or want to do your phds right so this paper usually was conducted by nta in an off in an online mode right online mode mein conduct hota tha that means the paper ke paper pen use nahi hota tha we usually use computers online mode ke andar but then an initiative was taken that why don't we try and have, conduct this paper for the entire nation on one day only that is on 18th june they conducted the paper 2024 in an offline mode that means paper pen ke andar we have mode change ho gaya and paper pen was used of course there are few do's and don'ts there are problems pros cons dono ke hi hote hain so when you look at a paper that is conducted using paper and pen it is feasible for the students to directly jump to the answers it is better of course visually also it becomes better bahut zyada problematic nahi hota because scrolling becomes a problematic situation when it comes to reading comprehensions or mathematical questions that are seen in your examination so it was of course a good initiative that was taken a lot of students who are not that good with computers uh, had an edge this time they could directly just jump they could solve the paper easily because they were not scared and of course there were few other initiatives that that of course was taken the centers were good but yes as i told you integrity was compromised so the paper had to get cancelled and they again jumped to computer based analysis now the timings were same the mode was different but and when the mode changes when it is computer based exam there are few sets of people who actually suffer right so these are the students who are not that good with computer or the students who are not that uh, quick when it comes to solving logical questions why because data interpretation and comprehension are few uh, are you know topics that become difficult when you are you know using the computer based mode but of course this time the cycle was completed very smoothly we saw all the shifts and every paper was conducted and now the cycle is completed so it started in august it it went till september 2 to 3 september and the cycle is now completed the question arises now when will be the next cycle now will be uh, will there be an exam in december so yes this cycle was of course due for june so ye june 2024 ki cycle thi that happened in august but i don't think and the, i don't think that aapka jo next cycle hai that would be compromised they will again take an exam Uh, they will again take conduct the exam in december right so you have a few months left and you guys have to gear up study hard for your december cycle in december again paper would be conducted again in computer based mode and you need to just 
revise a lot of things you need to curate a lot of things again and you need to start bucking up and studying for the next cycle now there were students who gave the exam on 18th june then a lot of students decided not to give exam why because they thought that they have done really good while there are some students who are very dejected some who will clear paper some who will not be able to clear the exam right so there are so many different groups that will be created but what is the holistic approach a person should have you guys should start studying for the next cycle if your paper was good then you can you know just you can at least rest if you think that your paper went really well then you may rest but i would suggest you to at least just start studying or revising the things that you have curated or collected right and if you are new then of course you can start preparing because definitely in december 2024 ugc net exam will be conducted again because it happens two times in a year okay so do bari hota hai ye saal mein so definitely there will be another exam in december now let us talk about the overall examination how it was what type of questions came so when the exam was conducted on 18th june we saw that yes the paper was easy i talked to a lot of students they came to us and they just declared that yes the paper was easy but lengthy lengthy tha definitely data interpretation and comprehensions were a bit difficult then the cycle shifted so what happened in august cycle the paper became lengthy the paper was not that difficult right there are so many different subjects there are so many different people and a lot of different opinions but when you just holistically look at the opinions they said that the paper was moderate it was not easy it was not that difficult it was what it was moderate so paper moderate mein aata hai as we all know there are 10 units and from each unit from each unit questions were asked and from if you look at the past trends ugc was asking very different questions and now the pattern is changing when it comes to paper 2 that is your subject paper it is coming a little difficult right so paper 1 relatively is easier but lengthy or you can say moderate but lengthy and your subject papers are getting more and more tougher more and more comprehensive and this is what i have collected uh, you know by talking to a lot of students for example i have students from environmental sciences right so they told me that the paper was asked in a lot of detail like bahut zyada comprehensive questions the uh, for example environment se related bahut zyada comprehensive questions aaye while i have students from english literature in our batches only they tell they told us that yes the paper was difficult especially when you talk about english it was the second shift that was more difficult why because they are now asking a lot of comprehensive questions and chronology based questions so you need to learn a lot of dates you need to learn a lot of information factual information we saw that the paper is becoming more and more factual now it is becoming more and more comprehensive and yes it is becoming more and more detailed so basically you have to be a quick learner smart learner a proficient learner who can uh, understand the things quickly because they are using analysis as a basic tool right so when you talk about paper 1 so paper 1 has 10 units let us talk about each unit what basically was asked when you talk about teaching aptitude that is the first unit we saw that they are asking a lot of questions from swayam mook they are asking about moodles they are asking about tools especially the modern tools that are used what is mookit right what is lms right they ask questions related to lms a lot of times they have already uh, shown us that swayam and swayam prabha are the topics that they will ask questions from but this time they went one step further they asked about the channel not only that they asked about the names of that channel and also they asked about the coordinators so who coordinates the first 10 channels who coordinates the websites so these were the questions that they were asking they asked questions related to swayam swayam prabha mook and as i told you about tools also 
then they are asking a lot of questions related to cognitive cognitive learning theek hai cognitive learning and metacognition and metacognition now these are the topics that they are again and again asking self directed learning humne class mein kiya tha self directed learning ka model class mein kiya zimmermann's model and that was asked in the paper different types of knowledge different types of memory these were the questions that were asked so i would say that teaching is teaching aptitude is getting difficult it is not that easy they are not asking straight forward questions but in depth analysis is needed you need to study hard when it comes to teaching aptitude then of course research now this is a topic that is not going to change this is something that is good here as well so probability probability scales as well as types of research types of research ye aise three topics hain as well as plagiarism yes they asked plagiarism ke bare mein bhi this time so these are few topics that they asked almost in every shift this was the most important topic as well when we discuss these things in the class we already tell you that ye hamesha paper mein aate hain so types of scales nominal ordinal types of research quantitative qualitative probability ye sari cheeze are very very important right so research was a topic that is of course not going to change you read as much as you can about the research it is always going to pay then we have comprehension let us talk about comprehension so comprehension was relatively lengthier this time i would say easy but lengthy right so five may say three questions four questions up easily kar paoge one question ke liye you have to think a little bit because they are checking your comprehensive skills so that is important then data interpretation was easy right when when the paper was conducted in an offline mode the data interpretation topics were difficult but this time it was easy income expenditure profit and loss these are the things that they were asking mathematical section was also easy right a boon for almost every child that i know so maths bahut easy tha data interpretation easy tha comprehension moderate rakh lete hain data interpretation mein the students were able to solve three to four questions one definitely is comprehensive you need to calculate a lot there then they asked about successive discounts they asked about probability and etc right they asked about uh, compound interest right simple interest these are the things that they asked so you need to learn and you need to revise the formula so then of course you are good to go they also asked about the sequential questions sequence bhi pucha uske baad there is another topic that is very very important that is the logical reasoning part theek hai so bachcho ko logical reasoning mein problem hoti hai and logical reasoning was this time very very different than what usually was asked why because this time unhone western se zyada pucha fallacies that are western philosophies so usually they used to ask about nyay they used to ask about uh, the different theories like fun right unse pooch lete the but this time they asked about fallacies a lot of questions about two to three questions related to fallacies syllogism they asked about mood they asked about figures right these were the questions venn diagrams bana ke solve karne ke liye aapko aa raha tha paper mein so this means that logical reasoning ke andar western fallacies are also important please understand that sirf aur sirf hum log ko indian logic nahi karna hai not only indian logic not only indian logic but it is also the western philosophies that you have to learn and they are asking a lot of questions from here moods and figures that we thought are few things that are very easy were asked in your paper so benefit to everyone then comes comprehension sorry then comes communication so communication ab now what is happening in communication people usually study normally communication kya hota hai what are the types of communication what are the barriers to communication they are fully dedicating the paper to one thing that is mass communication mass communication se related questions aa rahe hain they ask questions related to media like hot media as well as cold media aise hi push media ya fir pull media ye sari cheeze they are asking marshall mcluhan jaise philosopher jaise you know uh, philosophers are important they as a theorist are important so you need to study 
uh, mass communication in greater detail theories like gatekeeping agenda setting theories they are all very important in communication then we have ict so ict is a part that is getting difficult they are asking about trojan horses they are asking about virus in fact this time they asked about hexadecimal conversions ict ke andar ict mein conversions kafi zyada aa gayi theek hai so they were asking about conversions conversions pucha they asked about what they asked about uh, different types of uh, say they asked about digital medias they asked about cds they asked about dvds these are the things that they asked ram rom ye question repeat hua hai har jagah pe ram rom pucha hai they are asking about conversions hexadecimal and these are the things that octadecimal was also asked right so ICT a topic hai that is difficult i would say this time it was difficult then what is left environment what all was asked in environment agar hum environment ki baat karenge people development and uh, people development and environment so this is a topic where you are expected to read a lot right but still this time they again focused a lot on protocols protocols pe focus kiya unhone kis pe kiya protocols pe focus kiya they also focus a lot on sdg and mdgs sdgs and mdgs not only this not only targets indicators publications they were all very very important they talked about the protocols the environmental conventions they asked about international alliances that are made right so these are the things that they have been asking so environment topic bahut unexpected nahi the ict was unexpected and difficult while environment se topics unexpected nahi the right pollution har bari we tell you that pollution is one of the most important topic and this time also water pollution air pollution diseases what are the pathogens these are the things that they asked and they have been asking so i would say it was only communication and ict that was unexpected and difficult because the questions were not that comprehensive to the students while logical reasoning logical reasoning data interpretation maths aise topics were easy this time and the students were able to understand and solve while teaching aptitude is becoming more and more comprehensive and detailed so these are the few things that we analyze when we look at the changing trends so i would suggest you to study harder right even more harder why because the paper is becoming detailed analysis bahut zyada bahut deep analysis is needed comprehensive it is becoming more and more factual and when it comes to paper 2 it is important to study all the dates chronologically you have to solve everything for example a lot of writers indian writers were asked about whom you do not even know and you need to know the birth dates of those writers right so these were the things that were asked you have to learn a lot and for learning a lot you need good information good sources good sources just tap on those information that you have revise learn revise and learn the, these are the two things that you have to do right so i hope you understood the, these 10 units on me se kaise questions aaye how paper and the pattern of the exam is also changing how they are asking detailed question how they want you to analyze the things further so the paper is yes becoming comprehensive i would say the cycle was moderate not that difficult not that easy the students who studied properly will be able to clear the exam right so now we have to back up and prepare ourselves for the next cycle that will happen when in december so december mein dobara cycle hogi and i'm pretty sure we guys are going to study even harder for that exam right thank you so much i hope i've cleared all your doubts if you still have any doubt you can ask me that in the comment section and i'll surely reply to you thank you have a wonderful day and start studying Thank <laughs> you.